they played the video on Easter in front of everybody and I was so embarrassed because I don't like to cry in front of people. I don't like being that vulnerable and open. So having the whole church and everyone else who came into church that day because Easter is a high traffic day at church, of course, having everyone come in and see this vulnerable moment that I had on camera, I was so embarrassed and I was not happy about it at all. <laughs> I was trying to avoid people and it was so embarrassing. <laughs> And I remember we were doing Welcome to another episode of Conversations with Clarissa Live from the prayer closet um, I did an interview today And it made me think about How the stripping labels came about And an incident that happened That really solidified me Making the stripping labels cards And putting it out to the public so this was back in probably February or March. The church wanted us to come in and just share our testimony. And I remember I had a whole list of everything that I wanted to talk about. And I had talking points and Sean and I was stressing my husband out, Sean, making him go over what exactly we were going to say, how we were going to say it. And, you know, just trying to practice for this interview and I remember when we got there the pastor he just took my notes for me and was like no we're just gonna talk about it and <laughs> let everything flow and during the time they asked why you know Christianity basically and how do I know about Jesus and I was just talking about how much he loves me and I just fell out crying and I was so emotional talking about it and I remember afterwards they said how great it was because it was raw and, and you know emotion because it was real and it was like I'll tell anybody how much I love Jesus and even think about it now it makes me emotional but I'll try not to cry for you guys today um but they played the video on Easter in front of everybody and I was so embarrassed because I don't like to cry in front of people I don't like being that vulnerable and open so having the whole church and everyone else who came into church that day because Easter is a high traffic day at church of course having everyone come in and see this vulnerable moment that I had on camera, I was so embarrassed and I was not happy about it at all. <laughs> I was trying to avoid people and it was so embarrassing. <laughs> and I remember we were doing a, um, we were doing a class uh, for finances, the Dave Ramsey uh, course through the church. And one of the ladies in the class came up to me afterwards and she told me that how grateful she was that I shared that experience and she told me that she wanted to feel that love from Jesus too that she wanted to know what that felt like and how she felt like no one loved her and we were both super emotional and crying about it and it made me realize that wow people really need to know who they are in God and how much God really loves them. And fun fact, I've been sitting on the stripping labels cards at this point for months. I am a perfectionist, as I told everyone. I question everything I do. I had spoke to multiple people at this point asking them to go over the cards and to make sure they were right and make sure that I was putting the correct scriptures and to just, I was very sensitive about putting this stuff out because I didn't want it to be wrong and I wanted it to be perfect because Jesus is perfect, you know? I was like, I have to put out perfection and I was very apprehensive about putting out the cards. So when she came to me and she told me what she was feeling, I immediately was like, immediately I was like, 
I need to give her these cards. And I told her, I said, next time I see you, I have something for you. And I think it's really going to be good. I think it's really going to help you. And so therein started the process of actually putting the cards into production. Um, and I now had this fire to make sure that I gave her these cards and that I shared what I have been feeling for months now, the, the love of Jesus Christ, our savior. I had to share it with everybody I could and I couldn't wait to give her these cards. And so that's how they finally came into production and I was able to give her the cards and she was grateful and she's doing amazing to this day. And I just love her and I'm hoping and praying that anybody who comes across this, um, anybody who is struggling to find out who they really are in this world and what their purpose is here for and just finding love. Um, a lot of times we look for love in people. We need to find that love in God and not in man and man meeting meaning people like we so often look for love from other people when we really truly need to find it in God and he is the only the only only person who can give that to you um and I pray that anybody who comes across this video, I pray that everybody gets to experience the love of Jesus Christ like I feel it. <laughs> like it's no greater feeling and literally it gives you a greater sense of self. It gives you a greater sense of purpose. And I really pray for each of you who are watching this video and it, send it to somebody who you feel like needs it. Jesus loves you and God loves you. And that's why he gave us his son to die on the cross for our sins. And I pray that everyone gets to feel that love and experience that because there's literally no greater love. So thank you for listening. And I will see you guys next time on Conversations with Clarissa. Have a good night.